What's up, guys? Alex and I wanted to welcome you to our home workout series, TB12 Home Turf. We focus at working out at the speed of sport with a form first approach. So, you will be performing these functional strength and conditioning exercises using your body weight and resistance bands. Part of the reason why we like using resistance bands is because you're able to train fast, allow you to maintain a full range of motion without putting any stress on your muscles and joints. We love these workouts because they will get the best out of you and have you feeling your best. So get ready to get moving with TB12 Body Coach, Devin. Today what we got for you is a partner's exercise. What we're gonna be doing is eight exercises, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, three times through. Let's get it started. First exercise is gonna be the glute bridge with pal off hold, okay? So what we're gonna have, we're gonna have our partners laying equal distance from another, getting a little bit of resistance on this band here, and we're gonna stay static with this pal off press. Hands aren't moving anywhere, they're always gonna stay center of that chest. And what we're gonna do at the same exact time, we're gonna come up into a glute bridge, squeeze those glutes all the way back down to the ground and right back up. Very big when it comes to partner workouts, is gonna be making sure you guys are in sequence with each other, all the way up, all the way down. As you guys feel that rhythm, don't be shy to start picking up that pace. Right after that, we're gonna go into the pal off squat. So what we're gonna do, same thing, this is static here. We're staying off in a static pal off. They're gonna come down, we're just gonna do a regular squat all the way down, all the way back up, and let's kind of try and pick up that tempo a little bit. Up and down, up and down. The goal here is those hands, much like any other pal off press, is staying in the middle of the chest. You're not letting that thing deviate to your partner. Now we're gonna go right into lunges. Lunges, we're gonna be right in that loop band. Partners are gonna face away from each other. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna alternate, okay? So for this segment, we're gonna go left foot first, okay? We're gonna forward lunge, come right back up, forward lunge, right back up, alternating sides each time. As we do this, we're still staying tall, nice and tall in that spine, always trying to find that pelvic neutral position, never letting that back start to arch, okay? The core is on, the glutes are on. Three more, three, two, and one, nice. All right, right into the rows. We're gonna get out of the loop band. Partners are gonna be facing each other. We're gonna have a little bit of a gap here where our hand space is, okay? At the same time, same thing, very key. If you guys need to count to stay on track, feel free to do so. We're gonna do a row, double arm row all the way in, all the way back out. Same thing, speed of sport here, guys. We're going as fast as we can while keeping up the pace of the other partner. All right, we're right into the next one here, guys. Push-ups, okay? No need for a band on this one. You're gonna be facing your partner. Counting out loud, getting those push-ups down, okay? If you need to, you can always modify here. If you're gonna modify, the same rules apply. Nice flat back, squeezing those glutes. Same thing here, flat back, squeezing those glutes, going right into the push-up, let's see it. All the way down, all the way back up. Nice fluid tempo. You'll start to notice as you get fatigued, those glutes are gonna kinda start relaxing on you. You gotta squeeze them, keep them squeezed. If you feel like you can't, Reset, rest, or go into this digression, okay? Last one, come on, last one. Good, nice and relaxed. Awesome, and now we're going into alternating punches, okay? We're gonna be, one partner is gonna be, I'm gonna have you do the pal off press, actually. So you're gonna go pal off press, you're gonna be inside doing the press itself, okay? So one partner, same exact thing, it's static motion, we're doing a pal off press here, Opposite partner is gonna be inside the long loop band. Staggered stance so that she can get a good base. So we'll have right leg back just a little bit. Good. And then she's gonna be pressing out, all the way out, all the way back in. Nice and fluid, relaxing that upper trap, keeping that glute on, making sure that core is on as well. Our friend over here is gonna make sure arms are not moving, right? She's getting perturbations here, but she's gonna stick right to it. Center of chest, three, two, one, nice, nice and relaxed. We're gonna go uh, pal off running, okay? So same thing, we're gonna be equal distance apart from one another, make sure that there's some resistance on that band. We're gonna be in that pal off position the entire time. Hands are in the center of our chest, our whole torso is not rotating in towards our partner. 
All we're gonna do is we're gonna go um, high knees on this one, okay? So instead of foot fire, we're going high, nice and high, all right? Let's start it. Nice and high, core is on, glutes are on. Biggest goal here is to make sure that you do not close the gap between you and your partner. Stay separated. You got three seconds. Three, two, one. All right, guys, last one, we're almost there here. You're gonna have both partners inside the long loop band, okay? This one is gonna be a push-up plank with lateral walkouts, all right? So partners are gonna be in a plank position, push-up plank position, glutes are on, back is flat the entire time, neck is neutral, and we're gonna have them two steps out to their uh, respective right and left. So one, two, right back in, one, two. Right back out, one, two. The biggest thing here, guys, is as you're moving, this is dynamic stability, so we gotta make sure that even in the movement, the glutes are on, the core is engaged, we're not having any excess movement here in our body. Last one here, last one. Almost there, almost there, and good, nice. All right, that's all we got today, guys. Back to you, Tom and Alex. Thanks so much for joining us at our TB12 home workouts. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope you got a great sweat in, and now it's time to recover. After your workout, it's important to prioritize your recovery with pliability, hydration, and get a little protein. If you put as much focus on your recovery as you do your training, your performance will reflect it. So keep up the great work, and we'll see you next time on TB12 Home Turf. Let's go.